Hello and welcome to the Fink Lab again. Um, today I'm going to do egg in a bottle. So for this you need a milk bottle. If you have one, you just need to make sure that the, the um, bottle opening is bigger or smaller than an egg can fit in it. And your next ingredient would be this hard boiled egg. You want a hard boiled egg because obviously if it was soft boiled, it would crack and bake a big mess. If you want to, you can put a little oil around the rim to make the egg sink in a little faster when the experiment happens, but it's not necessary. And then you'll need a little piece of paper and some sort of a flame. I've got a candle here and an adult. An adult will have to be present to help with this because, um, oh, I've got to stop that. Because uh, otherwise, there. Otherwise, um, you, you shouldn't be playing with fire. So what you want to do is you want to take the egg out. Well, first try and push it in. Can it go in? If you really, really forced it, it could go in, but it can't fit in. So I'm going to light this piece of paper on fire. Again, you need an adult for that. And you're going to put that in. You're going to, you're going to put the egg in right away. Ah! <laughs> Did you see that? It happened so fast. <laughs> so what happened is as the fire goes out and the air cools in the bottle, the air contracts or gets smaller, and the pressure or force of the air... On the outside it, or pressure in the in the jar is less than the air on the outside so the higher pressure air outside pushes the egg inside the jar look now it's stuck how am I gonna get it out of there you're gonna have to cut it out of there so very easy experiment very fun happens quicker than you think and that is our experiment from uh, Think Labs today. I hope you enjoyed it. And remember to get a parent to help you. Until next time, fairly, whoop, fairly well.